Pancho Panchito, tú eres mi amorcito, ay Pancho Panchito, tú eres mi amorcito, ay Pancho, ay Pancho. Warning, the following videos aren't intended to hurt and or bully anyone. It's solely my job in salvation to report on what's going on with the YouTube community and give my opinion because my opinion matters. Sorry about that. Weenie Hut Jr. discretion is advised. So we were able to interview Yawatsi and her old friend. Allegedly, don't ask me how, but this is what happened. Make sure to smack that like button. Um, girl, you know. Did I have you for a class? You know, you know, Yawatsi, don't even play that because you know that all of us that would have the same friends, you know that everybody here knows that in high school, if somebody's being bullied, everybody's gonna know about it. You were the popular cheerleader. Yes, you were that girl that people okay. liked. So then you you remember, right, how the football team wanted to gang me and my friends? You knew that, right? Um, you actually, that? And how the football players would constantly harass us? You knew that? Actually, the story, it's not I even like that because there was videos of you sending to all the football players. This, I've never sent a in my okay. life. Right. The time yeah. I sent and a note, of a young girl who's gonna say of a young girl from 15 years ago you who's gonna yeah, do that Lord, i've never sent you in did. my life okay so okay say i did send some that i never did right that gives the right guys to say they want to gain and say they want to attack me right it's the fact that you were sending and telling people you wanted to run with them but for okay, you to go, okay, see, for I did want to for I you to want to okay, per, I want to down. But but that's okay for people to bully me because I want to down. Nobody was bullying you. This is what I'm trying to point out. So, Nobody okay, bullied so, you to that so extent. People, so Nobody people bullied fun you. of my hair. Sure, people yeah. telling me to not invite you out to the parties. All of that stuff is not bullying, girl. You were what about you weren't even in my class you literally did not see anything that's why i'm so confused a ver if you know me so well who were my friends my only friends in high school a ver i don't want to name people Ay, so, mi amor. i ain't like you i don't want to name people you ought to because you know damn well all your followers are gonna go after them the way they went after me why would they go after my friends though they did nothing wrong with me i literally only hung out with two people in high school because now nobody you're lying me. now you're lying because you what? you had more friends than two people what i'm so dead you guys i am dead okay i have never ever sent a in my life i oh. told you guys girls would call me a in high school sorry your man looked at me Her. like sorry about that <laughs> Back to where we were at, sorry about that. So we kind of left off, I think the last the last part, let's try to uh, be a little more cautious with our words so we don't get banned here. So yes. we'll kind of just, you know, say cocodrilo or something else instead of, you know, okay. the other words. But okay, so where you guys were off, you guys can go ahead and continue, I'll sit back. Well, my question was like straight to the point. So you're saying that I never got bullied. Um, I, I completely disagree with that because you're my friend and you didn't know anything about me. You don't even know who I hung out with first of all and then you're saying that you weren't a bully right that's what i'm saying okay so you don't remember in fifth grade when you were new to the school and me and my friend befriended you but how you would make fun of me no te acuerdas or, or... um actually i mean one at, if a, time, I could, one at a time go ahead leslie if i could have put that girl and tagged her she would have she's on my side me and her messaged each other already because I know clearly who you're talking about. Me too, but mm. of course the bullies would link so, up together. <laughs> she never, never bullied you, you at sea. She was okay. okay, okay, I'm going to tell you a scenario. You tell me if it's bullying or not, okay? So do you remember how you dated the guy that I had a fat-ass crush on? Both of you. Oh, okay. It's ridiculous to me because this is like mocosa. I just want to give you an example because apparently you don't remember. Oh, my God. A kitty, mama. Um and you you would go up to my face and you would literally laugh in my face and be like ha 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 he picked me not you because i'm better that's not bullying i never happened you at sea never. i just put it up i was not that girl in fifth grade to fight over a little boy pedro you you mentioned his name so Ay, pobrecito, no hables de él, pobrecito. you you mentioned his name on snapchat i'm glad you're looking at my snapchat anyway no people are forward <laughs> Okay, you know what? so I'm mentioning it. Pedro. I never dated Pedro. What? 
never dated Pedro. And I never, I was not that person if I was your friend to tell you, oh, ha, ha chose me. I never did. I, I'm so sure because I clearly remember that. And like, what's crazy was that because you were the bully, you probably don't remember that because it wasn't important to you. But you affected the way I felt in fifth grade. So best believe I'm going to remember that. Girl, you're saying I'm your trauma, but yet you're saying, I don't know who this girl is. Make I'm going to clarify what I so I knew you. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to clarify for you. I knew you in fifth grade. And I remember how you bullied me. After fifth grade, I don't remember you in middle school. I don't remember you in high school besides the time that you got in a fight with my friend. And I said that. I didn't say I didn't know you. I know who you are. I remember you from fifth grade. I'm going to remember a bully. But I don't remember you. Look, I'm Right now, what I'm talking about is the fact that you went on your story to lie and say, I don't know your bullies. Because one, people, no. People that know from fifth grade up until now, I was never a bully unless people treated me a certain way. I would, yeah, no shit. I'm going to, I'm going to defend myself. As what I'm doing right now. You're not doing it though. You're using platform to make I'm people. defending people, myself? You're using your platform to make people believe. Okay, first. who started? Who started? Girl, empathy. Who started? First of all, you're the one with the followers. So who started Who started it? it? Okay, I started it by saying that people like it ticked you off that bad that I said that people bullied me. Yes, it ticked you off her life. Bad. You shouldn't mess around with that bullying because people actually deal with bullying, and you did not Babe, like the fact the fact that I literally got bullied and you're still here as one bully saying. Anyway, I didn't get bullied. Stuff. You're saying I was your biggest bully and I was your trauma. But yet, it, when Travis it, Travis turned a year old. Who invited me to his birthday party? To his I invited you? On, you have the invite? On Snapchat, on Snapchat, you sent me the invitation I mean, because back then we were, you know, I see this was, ten, what, eight years ago? I don't so remember. Who sent you an invite? Conversation. What? What? You're kind of cutting off, Leslie. That's why you have to repeat yourself. You're kind of cutting off a little bit. Okay. Can you hear me now? Yeah. Oh, so you're saying that she invited so you to the party. She invited me to travis's birthday party he was getting i believe he was also being baptized because she mentioned something about it's also a baptism or it said it on the invitation it was a mickey mouse invitation i want to see so, the proof i clearly don't remember inviting you you invited I, me and you said hope to see you there girly you were a ver, you weren't at, girl this was seven years ago why would i save a snap okay. Say I did send you the invite, right? Because you want to go with that. Say I did. Okay. So, but, I sent you the invitation. Um, would you let me tell, me tell you something. One at a time. If, say that I can see the thing be there or whatever. I had no beef with you, dude. Yo ni me acordaba de ti. Like, ahorita, na, na, so nunca me acordaba de ti. I'm your boy. Because you said, we, you said we followed each other, right? What? You said we fo followed each other? Yes. Okay, but, Okay, a lo mejor si te invité, I don't remember. Nothing, ya, ya, ya no me acordaba de, I don't even follow <laughs> socials, whatever. But, what? It doesn't make sense then. If I was your trauma, why did you invite somebody who bullied you so much? Okay, I, I invited you, but what I'm trying to say was that right now, ya no me acordaba de ti until I saw that message. That you, you, like you, you felt something inside of you so intensely that you had to make that comment about me. And honestly... I don't give a shit about all the drama, the fifth grade drama. I don't care. You you bullied me whether it or not, me vale madre. But what I'm upset about is that you said that you personally knew me when you did it. And you said that I lied about getting bullied. Bitch, me and my brother got so bullied. Best believe we're going to talk about it on our platform. Okay. So first of all, you to come on here as an influencer and say, bitch, show your followers how to be an influencer, you no, babes. They know how I. They know that I say, "Bitch, fuck, pendeja, morra, estupida." They know how I. They follow me, they like me for that. It's the fact, though, that you're continuing to lie, and you're saying so many people in high school believe you. You start throwing names out there. It's not great because people were not like that, and you know that. And then for you to say, "Lo que tú piensas," "Lo que tú piensas," go and say, "I was a bully to you specifically." To you specifically, I would. Ever, ever, say it. because that girl i'm not gonna say names clearly confirmed with me 
I was never mean to you. I never. Okay, well, that girl. Okay, I'm not gonna say her name, guys, right? But I clearly remember that girl, and I actually just told Alex about it because she sent me a message. The girl sent me a message, but I didn't open it. She unsent it. But I clearly remember her too. I think I talked about this on the podcast, you guys. When I was moving on to fifth grade, I remember her. I me telling her like, "Oh my god, you guys, I'm so excited! Like, we're gonna go to sixth grade." And the other girl that she's talking about. I remember her clearly looking up to me. She's like, I'm not going to be your friend when we go to middle school. I'm going to get a, I'm going to get new friends when I go to sixth grade. And I was like, no, oh, shit. it doesn't make sense. You weren't even you're telling people there. Uh, it doesn't make sense. You're telling people I was bullied, but yet you invited me to birthday parties. And then you messaged me about your situation, about your I messaged you? The fuck? Your ex That's your opinion. Girl, you messaged me. I need your fucking opinion about what happened to me. The fuck? You are. Did you, did you not? Dude, if I would have messaged mess you, me. the messages would have been there. Girl, this, this was seven yeah. years ago. Why would the I... messages from 2021 are right there? Seven years ago, I'm talking They're about. They're still there. You know what I mean? You're just, you're just gonna continue with it. You're just a liar. You're just a liar. Look, and it's crazy. honestly, like, it's crazy that at you, the end of the day, you're gonna believe what you want. That's you fine. Only people bullies when you, they never a bully. I, you, you are a bully. and i'm so sorry you can't say out of the culo and you can't understand that you're a bully no you're you're just only a bully will act the way she's acting y'all i can't i'm gonna bully yeah, you did my life okay a bully will act yet you use your platform to have all your followers come to me and my kids well you're the one that wanted to throw shit on me so don't, don't talk, you know, talk about hey. bullies then don't talk about be people bullying you because, girl, you're the one that started it as well. What? Never you, you commented on my name. Don't talk about me if you can't handle the heat. Don't girl, talk about me. Do I see? Don't talk yet. about me. You have so many influencers you have drama with, but yet you can't clear things up with I've them. With who? Why? With because who? Exactly. You don't name them. Who you do don't I have drama with? I've I've you should always say, I'm not going to name names. Why? Ver, because you know. Quien? You know you know all the tea, right? A ver, quien? Who do I have tea with? You Since never you know all the tea with, and I guess you fucking you hang never out with never mention them. You never mention them. And that's the thing. Yet you have drama with people, but you can't mention them. Why? Because they're influencers because, and they have bigger Because it's not your business. I can state my drama, and I'm going to say what happened to me personally, but I'm not going to name drop them. Because why? Who's most like you? No. They have more followers than you, and you what? know people unfollow you. It's not about <laughs> followers, babe. At the end of the day, no, no. one's going to unfollow me because people follow me because they like me. It's not about the cheese, man. It's about the cheese, my girl. Do you know how many people followed trying to get cheese, man? I wasn't even doing it for cheese, man. So if I'm getting almost You got a thousand followers. I can. And they're going to run away after. You got off of this. So you're telling me that I got like 700 plus whatever on my counter, whatever the fuck I have because of cheese man. It's not even about that. It's the fact what that, that it's about cheese man. What I'm saying is it's about the fact that you're using bullying as a platform for yourself and it's not okay because um, people as I have said time and time again, me and Louis will always advocate for bullies because me and Louis were bullied hardly growing up. So I can't speak to that I'm okay. I don't care what this girl over here has to say because she's a major bully and I give you guys proof and can back her shit up. But me and Louis have been through so much shit. We'll continue to advocate for it so that people who go through what we've been through know how to defend themselves and stand up for themselves. No, you're, you're using it the wrong way. Pointing at people by saying that they were bullies because you're saying I was a bully. You invited me to Travis's birthday. You messaged me when you, what's her? Name? None of your business. Jesse. When Je you and Jesse were having issues, you messaged me and you told me, girl, we're having issues. I don't know what to do. I don't know. Bitch, do. I did not know you like that to be asking you for advice. You're crazy. You are just crazy. crazy. Only if I was with my ex baby daddy, I would have told him, like, do you remember this? But I'm not. But it is crazy for you to say that because you did message me and I was the girl that responded you and i was like i'm going through this other situation I so you think that i just messaged like 20 girls from watson ohio and waited for somebody to respond to me or what i would respond to you go back and forth that's what you're saying and that's what i'm saying you are I mean, where did i message you because i want the receipts i remember travis was a year old Wait. he must have been a few months 
but where did where did we have these conversations? I have messages from, from back in 2018 was Travis on Instagram, on Instagram, and it's just you messaging me, and there is nothing here besides now me replying. Pero aquí no hay ni madres of me responding to you. Aquí, a ver, dime dónde. Go back to your Snapchat. I'm telling you, it was on Snapchat. I don't have you on Snapchat. We had each other on Snapchat. I, I don't think I, I have. I don't have you on Snapchat. It's the fact that you're lying, though, all this stuff, because people are going to believe you're an influencer. And for people like me, they're not going to believe you. They're going to they're gonna believe somebody who has the facts girl that you have so many at the end of the day if you have the receipts and you're gonna speak facts they wanna create it if you're full of shit you're, like you are right now you're, you're not any sense you're not, no te van a creer. person you are that's that's what? what it is you're not gonna the person that you are you're cutting off yeah you're cutting off leslie what were you saying is it back uh yeah, it's just that you kind of cut off sometimes when you're uh, saying a sentence. But go ahead again. What were you saying? No, I'm just saying, like, she's not going to show her side and she's not going to show people how disgusting she is because, yes, she was cool back in the days. But I started seeing. I didn't even think I was cool. If she thinks I was cooler than me. And then I started seeing her podcast and I'm like, this girl's lying. Like, she's just totally. And that's when I was like, you know what? It's, that it's is just not okay. okay for her to use bullying as a platform when it wasn't. You mean using my voice as a It's not sense. using your voice because you're being a liar. Oh. And then so, we... So you think I just made up these stories out of my culo? That's exactly what you're doing right now. Y bien detailed y todo. Y con names y todo. Oh. But I just made Girl, I have names too and I have screenshots too, but I'm not going to post them because it's people that don't deserve to get attacked. Okay, well, I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to... Please, the um, somebody that was really close to you, I'm not going to name her, but you're going to know who. She had blonde hair. One of your close friends. Mm -mm. Yeah. She was really close to you. I would say really close, like comadre vibes. Like comadre vibes? Yeah. Like she was. So you guys were sisters. You guys were like sisters. Did her name start with a D? Yes. Oh, of course she would go to you. Girl. girl. Oh, well, yeah. That's of course. the girl. That's the girl that literally knew my ex was about to fucking do what she did to me and Travis. And she decided not to tell me till hours later. That If that's the girl that you're referring to, babe, it makes sense why bullies got to stick together, my love. She wasn't even a bully. She was what? just a friend. She has receipts. And I'm not going to... We were friends. We were friends. We were. We were best friends. She was... She was Travis's godmother because I considered her family up until she backstabbed me with what she did. Girl. She knew that she, she knew, and I have a police report. She knew that what my ex was trying to do to me and my son, and she decided to keep it a secret up until I don't when and tell me later. You are, are honestly, I make that up I, too. And I know so, I understand who went through with the, that. I have nothing to say because that I don't have a saying for it because i wasn't there and i didn't see those messages between you and him or whatever happened i wasn't behind closed doors with you but it's the fact that you have so many people close to you telling me how you dropped them because you became famous or you I'm just gonna drop people who backstab me my circle is closed because people who have no energy don't deserve my time no people, you have a lot of friends and I you have friends i dumped friends and me and Lily have talked about this openly on the podcast, and we have said time and time again, guys, if people give you negative energy, if they waste your time, if they backstab you, shoo them away. Because we don't need that. That's why my close friend circle is this big, and then I hung out with two no, people. It's the fact that people started saying the truth about you, and you didn't like it. So what you do when what? saying the, the truth, truth, you start truth was acting being like the victim, and you start that saying that the truth. Because I personally messaged you just how you could have personally messaged me because you knew who I was. And you could have asked me, like, you could have told me you were my bully, but no, you decided to go online or your story, whatever right. it is. Because you decided to talk on my name first, remember? I still messaged you but after the fact. You talked on my name first, right? And I asked you, when did I bully you? When I was I ever. And you ignored me. No, what you decided to do was, hey, you guys. 
follow me on Snapchat and there's more cheese mate. Why? Just for more followers. Because yeah. because I can. Because it's my platform. Like that. You're and just I do with my, my platform as I wish. Just like with your platform, you went to talk on my name, right? You did as you wish. You were I'm gonna do as I wish. On you were already on Instagram, so why take it to Snapchat? Because Snapchat is a good way for you to keep getting paid. So I that's how don't that's get paid now, but I'm working towards it. I I'm working you, towards it. That's why I'm getting my, my followers over there. I'm working towards it. Exactly. And you told people, follow me yeah, when you did. Could see. You clearly well, okay. responded to me, but you didn't. And then you're saying I'm lying and all this stuff. I never lied, you Yoati. Because I don't have proof from eight years ago. Who holds messages from eight years well, why, ago? Who why am I here, though? Why am I still here? Because you're an influencer. I follow you. You're an influencer. I don't do that shit. I just delete messages as they come. Okay, well, I have the proof. I just just showed you it's not proof so why don't you show the proof of snapchat when you invite it how do i know that travis's birthday party was also a baptism and it was mickey mouse theme how, how would i know that? If I was fully, like i said i probably did invite you because after high school i didn't if i followed you i probably did like you i wanted us to be friends i'm not sure i'm not sure exactly but, what I, was sure. but I, I i did remember you bullying me Does clearly but you're telling people I was your trauma and I was a bully. It doesn't make sense, you Okay. And then maybe trauma is too much of a big word, but you were a fucking bully. And I'm gonna remember all of that here. You might not remember porque a ti, it wasn't important for you, obviously, hurting someone's feelings. It but wasn't I important for me. I bullied you. We were friends. Uh, well, friends. And I literally have said that in my podcast that we have people who were our friends oh my god and we we literally did a whole bit thing about it about how people were our friends and how they would do shit to us no i didn't because i was already over your life that's or, fine you don't have to watch babe your life that's okay but the thousands of others like and enjoy i went and just like and okay the crazy um i don't want to say names but after i posted you people the girl from watson would message me and they were like dude i remember her too from watson she was a bully si quieres, yo te mando las, los mensajes por si tú les quieres decir algo al rato. but i'll send you the messages we're 30 years old i'm 28 babies i'm not there okay well we're 20 <laughs> even I go to people and i start harassing them about 20 years ago 15 years ago. Look. Yeah, the whole point as to you taking me off about this, because I already gave you way too much of my time. The only reason why I got upset and you ticked me off was that you said you knew me personally, which one is incorrect. No, and it was very correct because we were friends. A ver, you still can't answer who I hung out with in um, high school. I don't even, did we even go to the same middle school? Yeah. Girl, and now you're going to act like we did it. We have so many people that knew both of us would talk to each other i i don't remember having I classes in middle school. School. i don't know who you are no i know who you are, who are. I don't remember I don't know who i am okay but back in middle school you that girl that was always everybody's friends okay what? middle school was when i got the most bullied high school i stopped getting bullied so much because i glowed up a little bit but middle school no madness you guys me arrastraban ahí. Girl, we all went to PA Hall and also okay, don't okay, okay. We did go to middle school together. What about high school? What classes did we have together? When Girl, you're just you're we so did lunch together. We drifted apart after fifth grade, uh, yet we, started oh, we drifted apart. Okay. So you didn't know me personally, right? Yes, I uh, did actually because Oh my god, I'm fucking with it. This bitch is delusional. Okay, well, let me tell you what personally knowing someone means. You hung out with me. You at least knew who I hung out with. I knew who you would hang out with. I don't want to know. I'm not going to name people. I'm not nasty. You can message me on the side. If you're to no, me. I'm not going to do that because Someone, what you're going to know what you're going to And you having a conversation about each other's days and how we can, that's personally knowing. You just said that we drifted apart in high school. So you did not personally know me. I personally know you because you would message me here and there and we would catch up with life okay well i'm sorry babe but you look like a fucking clown like i am so sorry but you literally make no sense no you're not the one making sense. the only reason you're making sense to people is because you have the, the followers and let you me know, tell you, you make so this is that a great way to this life Pancho's followers a lot of Pancho's followers don't fuck with me but i don't give a shit right they don't fuck with me 
So if they knew that I was bullshitting, they would straight call me out on my shit. And they girl, be like, things not adding up. But I don't see the comments saying that. And his followers will literally be like, I sometimes they're a little biased and they'll kind of go on his side a little bit. But right now, they probably don't like me. They don't know you, right? Be calling it straight what it is. And that's not what the comments are saying, babe. Yes. If I didn't make sense, especially because of who I am and people that don't like me, if I didn't make sense, they would be calling me out on my shit right now. That is true. Okay. And then you know what? Actually, the only reason people are not citing on me is because I'm not exposing all those messages I have. I send them to Bancho for a reason, which Bancho, I told you, I'm not going to expose their names. And I'm. Do you have the Snapchat messages? I need to look for it because I don't have the Snapchat anymore. But like I said, this was eight years ago. Mm -hmm. But you clearly invited me and you did message me about Jesse. And I did tell you I was going through similar situations. Okay. So Look, I remember that. And again, if I did say that, it was from a good place in my heart. If I did invite you, if I did message you, that was from a good place in my heart. All right. But what I just don't agree with is you going online personally tell me when you don't. And saying that I lied about my bully because I did it. That's and the I'm only thing you. that yeah. But Anyways, it seems like it's like so repetitive. But yeah, because I don't seem to understand it. Messages, but don't blast those people, please. Because it is a just block him out. He can like delete the names. You I can delete that. Some of them. To some of them, oh. I was. So she look. So she, look, here's the thing. I don't like when I get screenshots sent and I don't have names to it, right? Because she she did send me some like uh, messages and stuff. But the issue with that is I don't know who wrote those messages. I, I don't know. She could have done. It. But she sent me the same thing. She sent me messages of people like talking shit about me to her that they're like, no, you're right, you're right, you're right. Like they're just hyping her up. But it's just like the same bolitas amargadas que se juntaban they juntas. You. So what do you mean bolitas amargadas? They were your friends. They bolitas amargadas en mi dosas. It doesn't make sense. You just, you're just a disgusting. They were my friends. But if they were talking shit, those were not friends. No, but like I told you you can lie to your followers and you can lie to all these influencers about who you are but watsonville people we still remember you and we still know we still know the girl that what send around nudes we still know the girl. no she still, she still said, know. no she said that i sent a video See oh no, she said I sent a video. Bitch, I all had a flip phone. I had a flip phone. Your phone went on the flip I remember. I remember. It's just the fact that it's not What's okay that? for you. Guys, wear my nips. She did it on the flip, flip phone. I had a flip. My parents wouldn't have let me have like a. I got a good phone after I graduated high school because I bought it myself. It was a razor. Prior to that, I had a flip phone. Como les mandé un video con el flip. It was a razor. Or a <laughs> somebody just commented. I remember Leslie. She bullied me too, bro. <laughs> They, I don't even know them. So look, uh, we're, I think we're kind of just at this point one in circles. Is there anything you guys just want to wrap it up with? Because we're just kind of yeah, going in circles. I just want to say she really is a liar. It's crazy. She can continue it because, of course, she's an influencer. She will continue with the lies. But like I messaged, I personally messaged her and I told her her conscience will never be clear. My conscience is so clear, babe. Because I especially, for the, especially for the fact that she called me a bully when I bullied her and we were actually friends is pretty weird okay. okay the fact that she just continues to lie about it okay. which is fine and like she said she doesn't remember she invited me to travis's birthday party what was her biggest trauma okay make it make sense you want okay. okay. to wrap I just it up. say just keep my name out of your mouth because you don't know me and i'm glad you, we never got to know each other deeper in high school i'm thankful you never went to travis's birthday party if i did invite you I'm grateful for that. And also, this is just for any of my Watsonville people watching. I have said it and will continue to say it. Not everybody was an amargadita like this one. There was so many beautiful, amazing, supportive people that support me and Louis. And we love to go back and meeting every single one of you from Watsonville. We love Little Fresitaville. I'll continue to go back and show my love every now and then that I can. Love Watsonville has a place, special place in my heart. Um, but yeah, I'm just, this is an example of one of those amargaditas that we always talk about, you guys. Hey, y solita salió to light. Esta solita se dio. It's not even that girl. I was, solita. I was happy. I had good high school years, actually. Good for you. Good for okay. you. I don't know. It's cool.
Okay, well, thank you so much for this uh, elementary reunion. Um, I don't, I don't know how to kick on here because I don't, I don't have this is in TikTok. But if you guys do want to kindly uh, a skedaddle, I would really appreciate that. Okay, bye. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate that. Family reunion. <laughs> really quick, before you guys skedaddle your way out of here too, what the flag in Dublin was that, man? <laughs> can you imagine can you imagine bro i just felt like that was just high school or not even high school sorry elementary drama right but they had their little family reunion everything's fine for the 15 thou while people on here make sure to follow this page my name is panchito and i really do appreciate you guys and i'm gonna go back on live on TikTok. So go back on live on TikTok. I'm going to have a debate there for you guys so we can hear your guys' opinion. You guys know how it operates. Follow this Instagram. You know I appreciate you, Chismosas. And that's it. I really do appreciate